I got to know on the phone anyway, Brian De Palma's assistant. And so his assistant was vaguely down with setting me up with an interview because he was in town. He was shooting at Universal, they were shooting Scarface. Mm -hmm. So he was in town and he was at Universal and they were shooting on the sound stages of Universal for a lot of stuff. So he was right there. And so there was talk. There was, there was negotiations. There was talk about getting me on the set of Scarface. Can you imagine getting <laughs> on the set of Scarface? There was talk about me going, being on the set of Scarface uh, and actually having a, you know, talking, uh, uh, watching him work for a little bit and then talking to uh, and doing an interview with him, which, you know, which I might, if that had happened, I might never have been a filmmaker because I might have just committed suicide after. And it, it just ne it never happened. It never, it never happened. But I even remember when, okay, well, it was done. It wasn't going to happen. And he was still, he was a nice guy about it. Really. He was like, well, I'm sorry, Quinn. Just, we couldn't get it together. It didn't, didn't happen. Well, part of that is all just like the function of having heroes, yeah. you know? And, uh, uh, and so like, you know, uh, like, like for instance, when I was, uh, you know, my, I'm still now he's one of my favorite filmmakers, but like in particular when I was in my twenties, um, you know, I, I loved Brian De Palma, all right, and I would uh, um, just like obsess about uh, uh, about like his stuff the way like any like big fan would obsess about either a movie star or a baseball you know star or whatever is like uh, uh, when his movies would come out, I'd be counting down the days to, like the first show of his movie Scarface would open, and I would go see the first show first day, all right. No one could go with me. I didn't want anyone else to. Really, it was too like a, it was like a religious experience. No one wanted anyone to, you know, uh, I don't want I don't care what anyone thought, all right. I just sit there and watch the movie. All right, and that's sort of like just kind of taking it in, seeing all what the story was. And everything. Yeah. Then I would go see the midnight show that night, and then I'd kind of like somebody to see it with me. Yeah. All right, and then I could really watch. Okay, I've got the story, yeah. I got the film. Now let's yeah. see how he did it. 